Y'all, it looks like Trump may have effectively killed Christianity as we know it in this country. Many evangelists are seeing the teachings of Jesus as something that is too woke. Evangelicals are now rejecting the liberal teachings of Jesus. Evangelical leaders are warning that conservative Christians are now rejecting teachings of Jesus as liberal talking points. Christianity Today said during an interview this week that Christianity is in crisis due to the current state of right-wing politics. Some Christian conservatives are openly denouncing a central doctrine of their religion as being too weak and liberal for their liking. Multiple pastors tell me essentially the same story, quoting the Sermon on the Mount. After teaching things like, blessed are the meek, or turn the other cheek, people have walked up to these pastors and said, where did you get those liberal talking points? Then the pastor would say, I'm literally quoting Jesus Christ. The response would be, yes, but that doesn't work anymore. That's weak. <laughs> when we get to the point where the teachings of Jesus himself are seen as subversive to us, then we're in a crisis. Moore also said that one problem is, is that many Christians feel alienated and lonely because politics have come to take over their community outlets that churches once held. So Trump has effectively converted a lot of evangelicals from the Christian church because they like his tough guy talking points opposed to Jesus's kindness. I mean, can you blame him? Who wouldn't want to follow somebody who's been found liable for sexual assault and tried to hostily take over the country? <laughs> and the strangest aspect of this is to me that a lot of these people feel alienated from their friends and family because they follow Trump, but they won't stop following Trump. 2024 election is going to be the most interesting in American history because now either all Christians are going to have to vote for this horrible, horrible man if they want to stay Republican, or the Republicans are going to have to reject Trump and then he's going to go run as an independent, pulling all those people away from the Republican Party. Do you think it's possible we could turn into a three-party system finally in this country? Or maybe a four-party system? We need a true progressive party in this country. Or do you think we're just fucked? <laughs>